Oh, welcome to Bailey's Bookshelf, where I answer your questions and read a book and tell it to you. Perfect. Hi, ballerinas. This is Bailey, and today I have a surprise for you. Another Bailey's Bookshelf. So, let's get started. Want to see me do a magic trick? Ready? Oops. <laughs> I just... I just pulled it out from behind the pillow. <laughs> it was there in the first place. You might recognize a familiar face on here. This is my friend Jojo Siwa. She wrote a book and I'm so excited for her. Like, she did such a good job and I want all of you guys to get this book. I read the whole book as soon as I got it. It tells about Jojo's life and what she did when she was little and some things she did like a few years ago and it's just really crazy events that happened. You might recognize her because she is on YouTube, she's on Nickelodeon, she's on so many things because she's been working so hard on everything. There is a link in the info box to watch a few fun videos we did with Jojo. For example, my ear piercing video. You can see these pretty little guys in my ears right now. They're new. I just got them the other day and I'm so excited about them. I've been having to go through a cleaning course. I've been cleaning my ears every day and Jojo was there with me the whole time through and I'm so thankful for that. If you're watching this, Jojo, Thank you so much. It's so crazy to look back on things that you never knew had actually happened to someone, especially when it's to a friend. Like, wouldn't it be crazy if one of your friends made a book? Or if your friends have made a book, wasn't that crazy when you finally knew that it was coming out? My favorite part of this book is her talking about when she was really little. There are a few pictures in here of her when she was really little. She's such a cute baby, isn't she? There's this part where she is only two years old and she become, she does her first solo, and I would never be able to do that. I was like, I think six when I did my first solo. Okay, now it's time to answer your questions. Lily loves Lily. Seven says, how are your ears feeling? They're feeling a lot better since I got them pierced. Like, they only hurt if they don't hurt anymore. Luetia says, have you ever disliked a food when you were little, but now you like it? I think I disliked squash a lot, and now I love squash for some reason. Angel says, have you read Chris Colfer's The Land of Story series? And the answer is yes. I love those books. I've read every single one and I can't wait for a new one to come out if it does. Clarissa says, how's Tulip doing? She's perfect, she's actually right here, but you can't see her. Let me do an actual magic trick. Ready, set, go, poof. Cutie. This is Tulip, she's really cute. I take care of her every morning and I just put some a little bit of Timothy hay in her cage and I fill up her water every morning if it's not full. I hold her all of the time. Kaylin says, can you tell us about your birthday plans? Oh, of course. I would have a sleepover birthday. I'm going to invite tons of friends, 10 maximum. That's how many friends I can do, but I have lots of family members, and I do not have a maximum for those, so yippee! <laughs> it's gonna be Christmas themed. I'm gonna have an awesome birthday. We're gonna watch Elf in The Never Ending Story. Tell me if you watched e either of those movies. Probably a lot of you have seen Elf, but if, but probably not a lot of you have seen The Never Ending Story, but it's one of my favorite movies of all time and it's really good. Aislinn says, what are three words you could use to describe Jojo? Friendly, energetic, and optimistic. Angelina says, Bailey, on a scale of one to 10, how much do you love your fans? 
I love you guys. Like, I'm so happy that you're here and you just make me happy. I love you so much. Scale of one to 10, probably 10. Alyssa says, what is it like almost being 10. Well, I'm, joy I'm enjoying every moment, a moment of being just one digit because I know it's only so much longer, I guess. I've been one digit my whole life. It's gonna be really crazy becoming two digits. Princess Sally says, Bailey, what have you been reading lately? How's the school year going? This school year's going great. Um, it's been very busy, and I have been reading Harry Potter, the second book, a lot. I also read Witch of Blackford Pond and The Sign of the Beaver. If you want me to read any books, tell me in the comment section down below, and I'll probably make a Bailey bookshelf out of them. Amy says, if a story was written about you, what would you want it to be about? Would you be a superhero? A princess? Animal character? Etc. I would probably be a superhero princess. <laughs> I am writing my own book, so maybe someday you'll be able to read it. I'll very much do a Bailey's bookshelf on it once I finish writing it. <laughs> Vampire Vanna says, how many times a day do you think about food? A lot. I'm pretty much always hungry. That's why I keep growing all the time. If you see one of my old Bailey's bookshelves, you'll know how much I've grown. Like, that was four years ago, five, four, five years ago, when I did Bailey's Diva Meltdown, and you'll see how much I've grown. Like, I'm way much bigger than I was. And that takes a lot of food. I'm actually thinking about food right now. My tummy is kind of food. I want foodie <laughs> right now. Please give us a thumbs up, subscribe, and we'll see you next time. And don't forget to buy JoJo's book.